Agri Enterprises, 11929 South Highway 63 in Licking is your full service farm equipment headquarters. Tractors, UTVs, mowers, power equipment, sales, service, and parts. Call Agri Enterprises today at 573 674 3705 for all your farm equipment needs. Fox Funeral Home is committed to meeting your family's needs during one of life's most difficult times. Compassion and professionalism are the mainstays at Fox Funeral Home, 128 South Main. Call Gilbert or Amanda at 573-674-2293 and let them show you how Fox Funeral Home can help with your family's needs. Friend Fitness and Performance has great fitness equipment and a highly qualified staff to work with you in person on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Go see Friend Fitness and Performance at 100B Deer Lick Street or give them a call at 417-331-9050. Friend Lumber is your friend in the home and lumber business, and they're right here in Licking at 145 West Highway 32. Their phone number is 417-674-3115. Stop in and let the experienced folks at Friend Lumber help you find just what you need for just what you're building today. Licking Christian Church has a good news message to share with hearts that care. Sunday school is at 10. Worship starts at 11 with a live stream of the worship service on their Facebook page. Go see the folks at Licking Christian Church, 318 North Main Street, or give them a call at 573-674-2055. Rennie Pharmacy, RX Boutique, and Heroes Coffee are all located at 100 Deer Lick, and their phone number is 573-674-2995. Check them out online at rennypharmacy.com and download their convenient mobile app to help keep you and your prescriptions organized. Rennie Pharmacy, caring people who care about their community. The store at 108 College Avenue across from the Licking High School gym has great food, fair prices, and fast and friendly service. It's already your kid's favorite place to eat lunch. Call the store this week for carryout and it'll become your favorite too. Showcase Originals would like to thank the Licking Athletic Booster Club for their generous donation to support this live stream of Licking High School Basketball. Phoenix Pond at 213 Highway 63 South in Licking has a great selection of just what you're looking for with fair prices and terrific customer service. Go check in with the friendly folks at Phoenix Pond and tell them thanks for their support of this live stream of Licking High School Sports. The Licking Branch of the Town and Country Bank is located at 120 Highway 32 West in Licking and online at tcbanks.com. Their phone number is 573-674-2241. Come in the lobby, go through the drive up, or you can take care of business online. Member FDIC. Christy Cook is your local Texas County, Missouri Farm Bureau Agency sales manager. Christy looks forward to assisting you with your auto, home, life, or business insurance needs, and she'll do it with professionalism and friendly customer service. Please stop by her office or call Christy at 417-967-3725. Please consider advertising with Showcase Originals. You can text us or give us a call at 
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the campus of Licking High School. We're getting ready to introduce starters for the varsity girls game between the Licking Lady Wildcats and the Lady Tigers of Stoutland. Number four, Lizzie Betts was just introduced. This is number five, Macy Gray. Shauna Looney, the freshman. Number 11, Leah Howitz, the senior. And number 12, the 5'4 junior, Bethany Kincaid. And now for the Lady Wildcat introductions. Hannah Medlock, number 15. Abby Sullins, who's coming off a big game from Monday night, 33 points. Kata Cook, number 44, the junior. And now for the seniors, their last home game. Kylie Ingram, number five. And of course, Kylie Taylor, number 14. Looking forward to Looking forward to tonight's game. Girls taking the floor, the referees finishing up, taking their positions. Scott Caden going to tip the ball, toss the ball for us tonight. Licking in the home wide, of course. Stoutland in their purple and gold. And we're ready. Abby Sullins, tip back to Medlock. Kylie on ahead to Medlock, way over to Sullins on the far side, across to Hannah, the familiar lob play. And that begins it. Abby Sullins for two. 12 Kincaid with the ball. Out top to number 10, that's Looney. Kata Cook, good rebound. Licking on ahead to Kylie Ingram, back to Abby Sullins for the long three. And she is apparently still dialed in. Inbound, full court pressure, of course, by Licking. Ball to Looney, number 10. She kicks it across to 12, which is Kincaid over to Gray. Take away, Abby Sullins. And lay in for Hannah Medlock. And they're dropping back. Looney, that ball's tipped first by Sullins and then picked off by Kylie Taylor. We're out to a quick 9-0 lead. Minute and a half into the game. Kincaid in the corner to Gray. Gray trying to go baseline. Steps out of bounds. Subs coming in for Stoutland. And they're going man to man, full court. Kylie Taylor with the ball against Kincaid, being guarded by Kincaid. Over to Abby on the far wing. Up top to Kata Cook. Back over to Kylie. Entry pass to Abby down low. Lefty little baby hook. Abby Sullins for two. This is Kincaid on the near side. Across to number 24 and then to three. That's Chapin. Back to Kincaid for the attempt. Rebound by Kylie Ingram. 
Over to Hannah Medlock, good entry pass to Abby Sullen. She's fouled. She'll go to the line for two. Presley Hart, the sophomore, with her first foul. Abby Sullins to shoot two here. First one's up and off. The now Abby will shoot her second free throw. And I think that gets her to eight points already. In just over two minutes of ball game, she's got eight points. That's Kincaid. That entry pass is tapped away by Abby Sullins, dribbled by Hannah Medlock for three. Off the front edge of the rim, good looking shot. Kata Cook on the rebound, the putback. And Kylie Ingram cleans that up for two. Kincaid, ball's tapped away into the backcourt. She retrieves it. Skip pass in, was not handled. Picked off by Kylie Taylor. Her pass is picked off. Kincaid coming back, goes to the left, and is blocked way ahead to Kylie Ingram. Gets a handle on it for another two. 16-0. Number 25 on the attempt and the rebound. That's Francis. 23 tries to go baseline and does. Presley Hart for two. On ahead, this is Sullins for three. Abby Sullins. And we'll go to commercial. Time out. Christy Cook is your local Texas County, Missouri Farm Bureau Agency sales manager. Christy looks forward to assisting you with your auto, home, life, or business insurance needs with the professionalism and friendly customer service you'd expect. Please stop by our office or call Christy at 417-967-3725. Agri Enterprises at 11929 South Highway 63 in Licking is your full service farm equipment headquarters. Tractors, UTVs, mowers, power equipment, they have it all. For sales, service, and parts, call Agri Enterprises today at 573 674 3705 for all your farm equipment needs. Agri Enterprises 119. Gray over in the far side. Back to Kincaid, over to the near side to Betts. Kincaid goes to her left, comes back out. This is Betts. She's fouled by Hawk, who had just checked into the game during the timeout. So Allie Hawk, the freshman with her first foul. This is Betts, Lizzie Betts, the senior. In and out, wouldn't go. Lizzie Betts trying her second one. And also a little too strong. That's Hawk on the rebound ahead to Lindsey Wallace over in the corner. Josie to uh, Keaton inside to Wallace. Back to Keaton for three. Kenley Keaton for three. The freshman connects. That's Kincaid to her right, being guarded by Josie Wells. This is Gray, trying to work to the right. Out on top to Betts, back to Gray. Top of the key, number 10, Looney, to Gray. Tapped out of bounds. by number 20, Josie Wells, gonna be Stoutland Ball. Sub coming in for Gray, that's number three, Chapin.
didn't have a JV game tonight because of uh, the long schedule and the senior night. So this is good that uh, so many of these girls are also getting quality minutes. Josie Wells on a good pass from Lindsey Wallace. Wells for two. Over in the corner to number three. Yeah, ah, she gets it. Chapin bounced around and rattled in. Lindsey Wallace over to Wells. Wells going to take a shot. And she does. Josie Wells for three. In the corner. Looney, number 10 with the ball out front, being guarded by Wallace. Over to three, that's Chafin, guarded by Keaton. She gets help from Zoe Dawson. On defense, Chafin drags her toe a little bit. And we get a travel call. Turnover. Keaton to inbound. To Dawson, back to Keaton. On ahead. Kicked out to Josie Wells for another three. I believe that ball was tipped. And Stoutland in a hurry on the way back. Number 10. And she gets it. Looney for two. And carry on Lindsey Wallace. That's a turnover. Going to be Stoutland ball. And here come the starters back in. 20-point lead. We've got a minute and a half about left in the first quarter. And the starters are back in. Uh, immediately tipped by Sullins. Uh, we're in zone now. And that ball was tipped. Tipped again. She saved it back. Kata on ahead to Abby for two. Abby Sullins, that lefty layup. Number 12, Kincaid, that was blocked. Medlock on ahead to Sullins. Sullins gets that one tapped out of bounds. Gonna remain licking ball. Opportunity to work on their inbound play. And Hannah Medlock, Coach Rissler hollering instructions, something he's wanting to work on. Ingram. Taylor back to Medlock for the three. Ah, good looking shot. It's going to go. She's going to find it. Good rebound. Hannah Medlock, she comes out aggressive. Good for her. Up ahead to Sullins. Sullins across to Ingram. Pump fake. She drives in. Too strong. Kata Cook, good rebound. And a put back. Kata Cook with her left hand. And we're under 20 seconds left in this first quarter. Tapped out by Taylor. Going to remain style and ball. Way over in the corner. Into the low post. Kincaid pulls it out over to Looney. Looney attempts. Doesn't go. Rebounded by Taylor. Five seconds. On ahead to Hannah Medlock, who was hustling. And the extra two. Once again, we'll hear from our sponsors during this break. Showcase Originals would like to thank the Licking Athletic Booster Club for their generous donation to support this live stream of Licking High School Basketball. Fox Funeral Home is committed to meeting your family's needs during one of life's most difficult times. Compassion and professionalism are the mainstays at Fox Funeral Home. 128 South Main Street. Give Gilbert or Amanda a call at 573-674-2293 and let them show you how they can help with your family's needs. Fox Funeral Home in Licking. Showcase Originals would like to thank the Licking Athletic Booster Club for their generous donation to support this live stream of Licking High School Basketball. 
Fox Funeral Home is committed to meeting your family's needs during one of life's most difficult times. Compassion and professionalism are the mainstays at Fox Funeral Home, 128 South Main Street. Give Gilbert or Amanda a call at 573-674-2293 and let them show you how they can help with your family's needs. Fox Funeral Home in Licking. And we're back. A little bit of a uh, redundant duplication there on the advertising. I hit the wrong button. Given some uh, extra attention to Fox Funeral Home, we appreciate them very, very much for being a banner sponsor with us all month this month. Uh, please take the opportunity to thank Gilbert or Amanda the next time you see them. Tell them how much you appreciate it. Uh, like I said last night, we just continue. That's good. Alley Hawk for two. People coming up to us all the time thanking us, saying they were sick or on the road, couldn't be at the ball game. They enjoyed watching it. But it's important that we let those sponsors know that as well, how much they're appreciated. Just couldn't happen without them. This is Wells on the attack. The Hawk in the corner to Lindsey Wallace. Lindsey takes it, drives, and is fouled on the shot. So she'll go to the line for two. Foul on number three, Chapin, the freshman. That's her first. Team second. Lindsey Wallace to the line for two. First one's up and doesn't go. Subs coming in for Stoutland. Presley Hart. Wheeler comes in. A little confusion here. Chafin gets set. Lindsay's going to attempt her second. And it's up and the strong. Oh, ball rifles around on the floor. Comes out to Kincaid. And she gets it to go. Good for her. Kincaid, number 12, the junior. Ball gets out of bounds. Long inbound pass to Wells. She dribbles out. Hawk at the free throw line. Over to Wallace. Looking to. She drives, kicks out to Wells. To Keaton. Keaton for three. That good shooting must be contagious. Ah, uh, Kincaid a little wild on the pass. It goes out of bounds. Turnover. Wallace picks up a dribble, kicks out to Keaton over to Wells, way across to Wallace. Just working around the perimeter, Dawson to Keaton. Off the back of the rim, rebound by Kate, uh, Kincaid. Over to number three, that's Chafin. Shot was not good, tapped out of bounds. By Hart, I believe. Might have been Grancis, I'm not sure. Stoutland tipped it out. And we have another line of subs coming in. Kylie Taylor on senior night with a group of girls that are getting some uh, maybe of their earliest varsity experience tonight. Certainly a good mentor to be out on the floor with them. That's a dribble drive, 13. Finley Sullins, she's fouled and will go to the line. Might as well be aggressive while you got the chance. Finley Sullins going to the line for two. And I just heard the announcer say I'm wrong. That was number 11. Whoever it was, she's a fine free throw shooter. 
Kincaid on the entry pass to 11, back to 10, back to Kincaid in the corner, and that's picked off. Outlet pass on ahead to Finley Sullins, number 13. All right, the motion, I agree on that one, PA announcer. Two preachers can't be wrong. And we're in the corner near side. Stoutland inbounds. Kincaid with the ball over across to Looney, number 10, to Gray. Back to Looney, back to Kincaid. And she gets the entry pass into the lane. Number 11, Howlett puts up an attempt, but it doesn't go. <laughs> ball gets loose, taken by Howlett, given to Looney, and she's fouled. Shona Looney will go to the line. Foul is on Tabor. All right, my list is not correct. Looney on the made free throw. Inbound by number 11. Oh, that ball's tipped away. 10. And foul called on number 11. And once again, Looney at the line. Shona Looney gets the first one. Now for her second attempt. We'll assume that her socks don't match on purpose. Always like to give a kid the benefit of the doubt. Ball's tied up. Alternating possession favors Stoutland. as it should when there's a 29 point lead. And this is Looney over to 24 and Wheeler drains the three. Kylie Taylor gets it on ahead. Into the corner, oh, that's tapped off her feet. And a backcourt call. In come four subs to join Kylie Taylor. The starters are back in. And picked off by Kylie Ingram. Kylie Taylor on ahead to Sullins. Oh, Abby Sullins gets her rebound and puts it back. As I mentioned, Abby Sullen just had a tremendous game uh, Monday night, hit eight three-pointers. And a travel. And Stoutland comes back with four subs. Medlock on ahead to Sullen's. Reverse layup attempt. Kata Cook over the back, push foul. And fourth team foul. First one, I think, on Kata. Long shot by Sullins, and she buries it. Abby Sullins for another three.
Out of bounds on the sideline. In uh, somewhat limited playing time, I've already got Abby Sullins for three more three pointers tonight. Was able to have a brief visit with her dad yesterday. I'm sure Abby would like to give him all the credit for uh, that lefty shooting style. Here goes Medlock, baseline up under the basket. She gets fouled, she'll shoot two. Like to see Hannah be aggressive, that's good. She's a ball player. So Medlock gonna go to the line. Foul is on Howlett, her second. Hannah Medlock from the free throw line. Up and good. Second shot up and bounces out. Off the fingertips, number 10, Looney out of bounds, didn't handle it. That's a turnover. Back to licking. The two seniors bringing it up. In the corner, Abby Sullins. That one a little short. Kylie Taylor hustling, got a hand on it. On ahead to Looney, and she gets her shot blocked. And a foul call on Abby Sullins. <laughs> the announcer, uh, referee put that foul on the wrong player, but they're getting that straightened out. <laughs> Got that straightened out. It was Abby Sullins. If there was a foul, it was her. Number 18, shots up and off the side of the rim. Kylie Ingram, Kylie Taylor on ahead to Abby Sullins. Lead pass to Hannah Medlock, and rebound. Kylie Ingram, good strong rebound. It didn't go, a lot of contact. Looney, ball gets tipped out of bounds. Good defense by Kylie Taylor. Going to be number three, Chafin to inbound. Looney on the drive, ball gets away from her. She gets a handle back on it. Swings it around, that's 23, comes up a little short. Kylie Taylor, Kylie Ingram, Abby Sullins across to Kata Cook. Kata gonna take it in and score. Kata Cook, the junior. Good work by her. Francis back to Chafin. Over to Looney, back to Chapin, tipped out of bounds, Kylie Taylor. We got a minute and 19 left in the first half. Appreciate you being with us. Appreciate the sponsors giving us this opportunity. Please say thank you to one of our sponsors this week. And Kenley Keaton was looking to pick that one off. Got a whole new crop of subs again. Looney. In the corner to Chapin, blocked by Wallace, out of bounds. We're a minute four. Quick entry pass to 25. Ball's tied up. Lindsey Wallace and Presley Hart. Alternating possession, gonna favor licking this time. Dawson up ahead to Hawk. Through the hands of Wells, out to Lindsey Wallace. She dribbles in, kicks out to Dawson for the three-pointer, and it's good. Zoe Dawson for three. The freshmen are making an impact tonight. Lots of good experience. Number three, and uh, from the corner, that's Chapin for three. 30 seconds left in the half. Oh, good pass there from Keaton. Good rebound by Hawk. Her shot is blocked. 20 seconds. 
This is Chafin coming back. She picks up her dribble. They swing it around. Looney over into the corner. Back to Looney. We're 10 seconds. Kicks it out to 25, and she banks it home. Three-pointer banked in. Grancis. And we're looking at a 30-point lead. As we head into halftime, we want to show you this sponsor reel, and again, want to humbly ask you to take a moment and thank the sponsors for this opportunity for us to showcase these kids. Agri Enterprises 11929 South Highway 63 in Licking is your full service farm equipment headquarters. Tractors, UTVs, mowers, power equipment, sales, service, and parts. Call Agri Enterprises today at 573 674 3705 for all your farm equipment needs. Fox Funeral Home is committed to meeting your family's needs during one of life's most difficult times. Compassion and professionalism are the mainstays at Fox Funeral Home, 128 South Main. Call Gilbert or Amanda at 573-674-2293 and let them show you how Fox Funeral Home can help with your family's needs. Friend Fitness and Performance has great fitness equipment and a highly qualified staff to work with you in person on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Go see Friend Fitness and Performance at 100B Deer Lick Street or give them a call at 417-331-9050. Friend Lumber is your friend in the home and lumber business, and they're right here in Licking at 145 West Highway 32. Their phone number is 417-674-3115. Stop in and let the experienced folks at Friend Lumber help you find just what you need for just what you're building today. Licking Christian Church has a good news message to share with hearts that care. Sunday school is at 10. Worship starts at 11 with a live stream of the worship service on their Facebook page. Go see the folks at Licking Christian Church, 318 North Main Street, or give them a call at 573-674-2055. Rennie Pharmacy, RX Boutique, and Heroes Coffee are all located at 100 Deer Lick, and their phone number is 573-674-2995. Check them out online at rennypharmacy.com and download their convenient mobile app to help keep you and your prescriptions organized. Rennie Pharmacy, caring people who care about their community. The store at 108 College Avenue across from the Licking High School gym has great food, fair prices, and fast and friendly service. It's already your kid's favorite place to eat lunch. Call the store this week for carryout and it'll become your favorite too. Showcase Originals would like to thank the Licking Athletic Booster Club for their generous donation to support this live stream of Licking High School Basketball. Phoenix Pond at 213 Highway 63 South in Licking has a great selection of just what you're looking for with fair prices and terrific customer service. Go check in with the friendly folks at Phoenix Pond and tell them thanks for their support of this live stream of Licking High School Sports. The Licking Branch of the Town and Country Bank is located at 120 Highway 32 West in Licking and online at tcbanks.com. Their phone number is 573-674-2241. Come in the lobby, go through the drive up, or you can take care of business online. Member FDIC. Christy Cook is your local Texas County, Missouri Farm Bureau Agency sales manager. Christy looks forward to assisting you with your auto, home, life, or business insurance needs, and she'll do it with professionalism and friendly customer service. Please stop by her office or call Christy at 417-967-3725. Please consider advertising with Showcase Originals. You can text us or give us a call at 
had been, and it's not, it's not by, no, it's not, the buffer's not even on. And we're back to action. Quick turnover. And Kata Cook bringing the ball down. Out to Abby Sullins for three. Abby Sullins. Going to shoot two. Foul on 15, that's Medlock. Gonna shoot two here. First one off the back of the rim. Uh, scrum on the floor. Stoutland comes out with it. Up and good. For Looney, for another two. Oh, on ahead to Kata Cook, good pass, and it goes, Kata Cook. This is Looney on the far side. Lob pass, Medlock picks that off. And she wishes she could dunk. Hannah Medlock, really good defense there. Looney over to 12. Back to Looney. She drives in, goes for the layup. Good rebound. Kata Cook, strong. Big smile on her face as she heads up the floor. Stops for a little pull-up jumper off the back of the rim. Rebounded by Stoutland. They're back at it. And Looney again puts one home. Little layup, Shauna Looney. I've got her for eight points now. Medlock on ahead to Kata Cook. Kata Cook a little too unselfish, which is fine. Tried to get it over to Sullins. And turnover. This is Looney, top of the key, six minutes. And number 12, Kincaid. Looney drives in, tries again. Kata Cook, another great rebound. Kylie Taylor with her head up as always. Medlock for the lay-in. Hannah Medlock. 
Seriously, she's going to have to work on Duncan if she's going to have breakaways like that. Here we are. Kincaid to Gray for three. Front of the rim. Rebounded by Stoutland. This is Looney with the ball about the free throw line. Over to number four. That's Betts. And we're back out top to Looney. She tries out to Betts for three. Yes. Number three, Lizzie Betts. Excuse me, number four hits a three. This is Sullins for three. And again, I'm sure she wants us to give all the credit to her dad for teaching her to shoot like that. Pull up 12, that's Kincaid, back of the rim, Kylie Taylor rebound. She's got her head up like always, sees Abby Sullins, lefty lay-in. Timeout. Friend Lumber is your friend in the home and lumber business, and they're right here in Licking at 145 West Highway 32. Their phone number is 417-674-3115. Stop in and let the experienced folks at Friend Lumber help you find just what you need for just what you're building today. The store at 108 College Avenue across from the Licking High School gym. They have great food. Kicks out, 24, 23, 12, that's Kincaid. Over to 24, that's Wheeler. Ah, Josie Wells gets a hand on that one. Good hustle. Tips it out of bounds, gonna remain Stalin ball. This is Kincaid to her left, kicks out to 24. Wheeler off her fingertips and out of bounds. That's a turnover. Lindsey Wallace to inbound to Keaton. Back to Wallace. Way across. To Josie, she gets a handle on it. On top. I can see that we're having a little bit of Wi Fi problems. Hope for the best. We'll get the clean recording put up this evening try maybe to make some adjustments before the uh, boys game see if we can improve things at all appreciate you being with us Keaton from the corner for three Kenley Keaton Stalin with the ball about three and a half minutes left Grancis to Chapin Good lead pass underneath, back out to Chafin. Big crowd here tonight. Keaton on the floor quick, and gets the ball tied up. Alternating, alternating possession gonna favor Licking. Wallace inbounds to Keaton. 310 left in the third quarter. It appears we will have a mercy clock running in the fourth quarter. And on the breakaway, it's number four. She gets it blocked by Wallace. Betts went up for it, was blocked. Lindsey Wallace, good work. Not only blocked it, but it ricocheted off the Stoutland player for the turnover before it went out of bounds, when it went out of bounds. This is Wells, she drives in, and Hawk gets a hand on it. Wells eventually gets it back out to Keaton, kicks to Wallace for the three. Tap from behind, but to another Stoutland player. And number one, no, excuse me, number four. This is 12, Kincaid, dribble drive, that's gray. Uh, skip pass underneath. Out to Kincaid for three. Wallace, good strong rebound. Uh, 
Three-pointer attempt for Kenley Keaton. Offensive rebound. Again, we apologize for the stream problems. We're trying to work those out and definitely try to have them connected before uh, the boys game this evening. And we're under two minutes left in the third quarter. In the corner to Chapin, out on top to Looney. Looney doubles back to Chapin out here again, trying to look for an entry pass out to Gray, to Kincaid, to Looney. S defense doing really well. And good rebound. Zoe Dawson, she just takes control and heads up the floor. This is Abby Sullins. She kicks out a little wide. And turnover. Appreciate you being with us. Minute left in this quarter. Again. Rebound, tapped out of bounds. Good hustle. In the corner, number three, that's Chafin. Shot was long. Up ahead to Sullins, and she's fouled. Abby Sullins for two, and she'll get the and one attempt. Abby Sullins. Up ahead to Abby Sullins underneath. Oh, good attempt. Got taken away. Kicked back out. Comes up just a little bit short. Enterprises 11929 South Highway 63 in Licking is your full service farm equipment headquarters. Tractors, UTVs, mowers, power equipment, sales, service, and parts. Call Agri Enterprises today at 573 674 3705 for all your farm equipment needs. Box Funeral Home is committed to meeting your family's needs during one of life's most difficult times. Compassion and professionalism are the mainstays at Fox Funeral Home, 128 South Main. Call Gilbert or Amanda at 573-674-2293 and let them show you how Fox Funeral Home can help with your family's needs. Friend Fitness and Performance has great fitness equipment and a highly qualified staff to work with you in person on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Go see Friend Fitness and Performance at 100B Deer Lick Street or give them a call at 417-331-9050. Friend Lumber is your friend in the home and lumber business and they're right here in Licking at 145 West Highway 32. Their phone number is 417-674-3115. Stop in and let the... And we are back. And 
Medlock with the rebound on the near side. She comes out on ahead to Sullins. Lefty three off the back. Good rebound. Kylie Ingram. She's fouled, gets her own rebound, and puts it back. Kylie Ingram, the senior. Out ahead, Abby Sullins, lefty lay-in is good. Abby Sullins. And we're running clock, mercy clock, Kata with the takeaway. On ahead to Hannah Medlock. She kicks it back to Kylie Taylor. Kylie Taylor playing in her last home game here at Licking, quite a career, quite an athlete. Kylie Ingram, also the senior, the Kylies. Kylie Ingram, good lay-in. And tipped by Sullins, but controlled by Betts. And taken away by, oh, tipped away by Medlock. A little confusion there. Foul on Medlock, subs coming in. We got a 49 point lead. There, they've got the clock running. And take away Lindsey Wallace. She's got one out ahead of her. She's gonna take it the whole way. Lindsey Wallace doesn't go. Ingram rebounds and puts back. Kylie Ingram, good work there following the play. This is Gray. Picked off by Wallace. Over to Keaton, over to Ingram. Nah, back of the rim. Hawk rebounds out to Taylor. Keaton for three. Oh, in and out. Hawk with another rebound. She just happened to be on top of the person in front of her. She was working hard. 33, Ali Hawk, her second, I believe. Kylie Taylor, ladies and gentlemen, comes out of the ball game. Five minutes left. Kylie Taylor. And that shot's blocked by Wallace, gathered in by Keaton. Up ahead to Wallace now. Wallace to Ingram. Ingram running up those career totals. We like it. Kylie Ingram for two. In the corner, Lindsey Wallace a little aggressive. On the reach, the freshman gets her first foul. That's five. Kylie Ingram, ladies and gentlemen. Kylie's hug there in front of the scorer's table. Good moment. These girls have worked hard, multi-sport athletes, fine young ladies. Very much appreciated. Clock continues to run. We're about four minutes. That one's in and out. Tapped out by Dawson on ahead. And Dawson off the front of the rim, rebound by Keaton. And she's fouled hard. Kinley Keaton, good work. She's gonna go to the line for two. Kinley Keaton, shots up, oh, in and out. Keaton again, in and out, consistent. And foul on Hawk for reaching around. Foul on 33, Hawk her third, team sixth. Gray bringing the ball up. Kinley Keaton out front. Dawson guarding. Oh, three-point attempt and fouled shooting the three-pointer. That's going to burn up a lot of clock by the time she gets done shooting these three. And that's not a bad thing. We're 250.
for a shot up and in and out. Number four, this is Betts, the senior. She's getting ready for her second attempt. Of course, some girls rushed in, but she gets three. We've got four new subs coming in. Lots of playing time spread around tonight. Third one is up and good for Betts. Two minutes left in the ball game. 52 point lead. Girls getting a good opportunity, work the ball around. Coach Rissler still hollering instructions and helping. On ahead, Gray up ahead to Betts for two. And we're a minute and a half, about to come to an end. Out on licking, we're a minute 10. Gray coming up with the ball for Stoutland. Kicks out, three-point attempt is good. Wheeler, that's her second three of the game. Licking on the drive, kicks it around, Wells. Uh-oh, nobody home. We're under a minute, appreciate you being with us. Sorry that we had some uh, stream difficulties. We'll get the recording over to uh, Facebook. Picked off by Wells, 30 seconds. About to wrap this one up. We'll have the JV boys following the uh, senior recognition. And then following the JV game will be the varsity boys versus Dixon conference matchup. So I believe this secures a conference uh, championship for the Lady Wildcats. I'm not 100%, but I'm pretty sure. Appreciate you being with us. God bless you. We'll see you back in an hour or so.